Hey everybody, it's Son of Peace and I am Terry Crews. This is where it comes down to this, the final two teams in a Stanley Cup final. This is where the matchup ends here for NHL Season 3 of EA Sports. It's the Hurricanes battle against the Canucks. It's all coming up next after this. Hello folks, Son of Beast here, and I'm DJ Beast. And this is where it comes in for this final game, or if necessary, will be game 6 to 7. So this is the last time that we're about to be seeing this one with the one match last up. This matchup is going to take everything around the globe. From in between Vancouver to Carolina, and now Carolina back to Vancouver, this is where it comes down to this. Will the Hurricanes win the Stanley Cup and crown as a champion of NHL 24? Or will the Canucks strike back and head to Game 6 back in Carolina? One answer, one possible chance, and we're ready to bring things on. Now, for the next commentary, I will have his fan, and he is also along with the other commentaries, with Nickel. And finally, we have his, across from the center ice, we have a one of our only biggest one that you're about to be witnessing, Terry Crews in center ice. Now, let's get this thing settled in, and the full commentary of the crew, I have one of our biggest. The one of the stars that I would be happy to have things covered in. And that means it's Boomer. Let's see how they handle with this last matchup. Canes, Canucks, ready for anything. Game 5, win to win all or head to game 6. Let's do it. Hey everyone, it's Fan and I'm here at Rogers Arena for tonight's game in Vancouver. It's game 5 of the Stanley Cup Final between the Hurricanes and the Canucks. We are ready to start things off and we are underway to get things started. And here we go, fifth game. Will this be a win for Hurricanes or will they come back in? Let's find out if there's a chance. We start things over as Petrikoff will have it again to Burns. Burns will give it over now to Spectrakov. He will now have his chance over to Burns. Nice shot. Stop by time, she does go. This one will put a rebound at Oppo and this side is back to Burns. He gets to turn a line in. The back behind the back is Petrikov to Oppo shot. Big save play here by Demko. What a better way to have this one and start saving the night. Had to be for Dr. Demko to have that one flying in. Here's Timo Terabainen, he is right toward right wing, he will fly in around the back. And here's a takeover to Svechikov to get to Burns. Burns shut off the blocker, but a rebound to Demko makes a stop. With the start of the period, Demko with a great save on his effort. We're coming down right now as we're still in the early stage of the period. No score to game. Carolina wins the faceoff, and here's Besser. What we'll a chance for a full breakaway chain. And stopped by Kurchakov. Back the other way goes. This one will stop inbound to pick up the rebound. You know how incredible is that? You tie all you got. They really are expecting that they are playing it like this, but that's how hard it goes in. I was really noticing that full breakout chain must have been Brock Buster. That really got that one with a great full chance breakout. That went really well. Here's Buster. This one will fire that one up. And here's Freeman again to Hughes. He shot score! Pretty has been really taking all this concentration. And you see what happens right now. That line must have had that one passing off. This one really took over, and this one fires that one off and right around the range. Maybe this one a little bit of a tip, and this had that one scoring that. Can that start things off? One of the in the first period. Stall as he will start to over to Stray. 
And here's Jarvis, not finding it over the pass again to Marna. Marna trying to watch it in to try to get away from the crowd poke check. Now the pass over to Stage. Stage shoots it. This is why that was off the pad. For the backhand and shot, and we got my stall. This one was stayed up, but this one sits in. Jordan Stall ties this game up, and this one will not even a game. Wow. How just lucky that happened. Jordan Stahl. First, Quinn Hughes made this goal, but now Jordan Stahl happened. You know, that flying inbound, and this one was tipping in there, it was just like flicking right in between. And then when he lost that one with his head, and this one's flying up. But then this one got bounced into trouble because that one just poked it in right in toward a net. That one just made this one slick. That one just made that one bouncing in there, and that just went right behind the goal line. So both teams are tied up as Pesky will have that assist to bring up in game five of the night. Easier enough to say right now, Pesky has been really taking it over, and sometimes how the effort is putting in for Jordan Stahl. He made this one an excellent to take over with the, with the shots on goal. This one really has been steadily all along. They're really expecting right now that they're playing this all over again. That they don't want that one to get up out of the way because if something happens, they're going to get that one here knocked out. Pesky shows that big stop here by Demko. Here's Bob Colson. He will have that one in the corner up. Got it wrapped up this time. Look again to Garland, and this one's blocked. Jesper Fast will now have it again to Martinuk. The pass over to Puck Enemy. Got the money in the bed pants. Martin that tries to settle the things down a bit. Shay shot. Put a deflection. This one stays out. Martin that now finds Pesky. Pesky wants to change it up a little bit to Martin. And this one will stay inbound as he finds Cop Canonymy. To pass, misses a shot. And Pesky will have it again in behind the net. Looking for a middle shooter with a puck steal. This one will clear that buck out in the Carolina zone. The Hurricanes are on its way back to the other side. And Nelson will have it in the corner. Oh, uh, here comes a break. Shoots it. Well, saved by Demko. An unbelievable stop. You know, that one's kind of like how bad that turned to be. Nelson with a cut break on chain. That one worked really well. Thatcher, Demko, that's one of the best elite wrist shot saves in this game. That's why his ability is calling a light work right in between of his zones. He can make that saving inbound right in between from the offenders to pick it up and the defenders that can blind that one and make this wild save earlier on the run range. This might be an easier trick here, guys. He's looking for his light work to take the effort. Chaffield shot. That went off the blocker and it goes up and out of play. Let's watch again one more time. Yeah, that's what Dexter Dimko is really making this one. Block or not stop. This chain needs to be having a little bit of a broken situation here. Have to make a block out of it, and you have to try and defend it yourself. You don't want that one to be coming straight out in front of the target. Our fish is getting ready to drop the puck here with only 15 12 to go in the first period. And the win will be JT Miller. Freeman will now have it again to Mikheyev. Mikheyev right towards the corner. Plus that, Fred is funny with the puck steal. That one's almost going to burn. Big wild, big time. Jury fires it. Well, saved by Demko. Just under 15 minutes remaining in the first period as you'll have another new change coming up. Now the teams are ready to put their lineup in. So score tight range here, 1-1. And with another win for Vancouver. In the day, we will now have it again to Besser. Besser give the pass to Miller. Miller trying to make his way across. Vashnago watching him. And Tavo Teravina will have it again to Svechikov. Ah, oh, here comes a chain for a chance for a lead. This one broken up the pass by Tavo Teravina. He will now find Burns. Burn shot. A little choppy out there as he lost that stick. Well, Blair had to replace him with a new stick, and sorry. Not to be pissing it out, I had to go retrieve it. Burns now finds Slavin. 
Slavin now fires again to Burns. Burns shot misses wide. And Slavin will try to get the rebound in. Here's an Irwin for Tebow Terabinen for the Kaibow Stars! Tebow Terabinen had an answer made with the 2 1 goal game. You know how excellent that is for Tebow Terabinen. You just have that one with the greater chance. Ski around the crescent and then right over around Freeman. That way made up in the block and this tricky chance deal on the effort. Thankfully, he made this one goal with a great chance. Brett Burns with the assist, and after that goal, it's a 2 1 game in the first period. A little early start out there, but hopefully, there might be another new changeup that could be happening in between. We're not sure what's going to happen. We have to find out if there is one. Better chance, better effort. Everyone's going to be playing how hard this is, and they don't want anyone to get out of the way. Demko holds a save right now at 13 18 to go in the first period. And now they're ready to do the next face off. Freeman wins the face off as right now Pedersen give it over to Freeman and now Suda. And here's Hoaglander shot. Up the club, and this one goes right to Natchez. Slayman will have the puck again to Bunning. Bunning with a chance at to play. Oh, what a save by Demko. Great wild run, and this one sticks it up. Great poke check here by Brett Burns, and this one will carry out. Vancouver back the other way. In the offensive zone now finds Hoaglander. Chance to play. Right towards the corner. Looks again at Cole. Drury with the block shot. Tries to keep it out. Now bringing the team back in. Bumping the corner in, and now Burns will have it. Burns gives to Slavin. And a big deep pass to Bunning. Bunning loses the effort. Suits it. With a rebound by Natchez. Right behind the goaltender. Paul Colson will have it again to Freeman. Freeman will fire that puck out. The range puts back in for a save. We will now have a deep pass to Stahl. Here's a chance. Jarvis lost that one and it goes right back to Cole again to the limo. And a penalty upcoming on Carolina. That's going to be a tripping call. You know, it doesn't really happen now because that slash and it's not turning what they're expecting to play like this. You know, that's going to happen to Jordan Stahl. Two minute penalty kill. Vancouver will start their power play run with their possession in, in the hurricane zone. 11-19 to go in the first period. The chance for a tie. This will go to Verona check for the rebound stop by Kochikov. What a wild save this is. And this one puts a start here nearing the back half of the period. Ako wins the face off as he will now try to get to Ako to clear the puck out. And now Besser will have a chance to corona it. Ako trying to get rid of it. Table to take it out. And here's Olander. Cutting chance for rebound. Blocked by Olaf. And then Sebastian Ako, he will pop out of that out. Corona. Cutting down. This one will carry it out and this one will fire it out. The Canucks got a piece of the hold of it with the puck and now will race their way to the attacking zone. Going right towards the corner, toward a cut inbound, another hit here by Carolina. And McKay will have another chance here. We're starting the effort and not finding Lindholm. Third chance to play, saved here by the goaltender. Just really how imagining this is, as Coach Comp is really like making this one a huge save. Better in competition, it's all inbound. Gotta take it in there if you can. Hollander with the buck steal. Got me a rush for a tie. Save! Oh, what a chance here for Hollander to tie this game, but it's stopped by the goaltender. Elias Patterson will have his ultimate rage. On his power play effort, he's looking to have his snipe to tie this up. 
but the better range is longer distance may be a traveling day to start that one on its way. The better effort is a better way to keep. Here's Scarlet right again to Hughes, and Patterson shoots it for deflection. That one will not get it in here as he will stick it out. Jordan Stahl's ready to go. He's ready to get back on ice. Jarvis, swing to Slavin, and the power play is over for Vancouver. Great chance here as he keeps that puck out. You know how bad as is all the upper. They're making this one a lot of a change off to make that one a message to get this one earlier. All that happens now, they just keep on playing it like holding that puck in. But trying to defend it wasn't really easy to try to let that one go right away. I know it's just how hard it happens right now, but they're really making the goaltenders a lot of it interfering that it might be one of a tripping that's going to be released on. I don't think it's going to happen like most of them, but probably it might be a change off if you're going to get it done. And here's McKay about their puck steal by Majors. Stopping the play about, and this one will go and goes right down, and Pesky will now try to get a little bumper car to stay. And a chance to Drury. Broken the stick here and then off to Bunny. Gonna have to get a new one out there. A little bit of cheapy stick out there. Might have to change it up what he can do. It doesn't really happen most of the time. How better effort is this? Mikhaev loses that one as Michael Bunny will have it the other way. Icy is waved off. The backhand releases. Save here by Demko. And Suter will have another way to get that one right on the other side. Shot! Stop here by the goaltender. This doesn't really happen most of the time. I mean, I don't know what's going to keep on going. That's a hard way to get that one in there at the right moment. And Horonic will now try to get back to Demko. And here's Pedersen. Hot still in here. Here's Aho! Cutting back! Poke it out. Slavin's got it across. He will now find Burns. And he will now have it again to Akko. Trying to watch it in. Ooh, a lot of big hits out there. He will fire that one around. And he has it to Burns again. To his touch of Akko behind Akko. Akko shot. Stopped by Demko. Under seven minutes remaining in the first period. 2-1 score. And between the zones, Sebastian Abo is one of the third eye ability. He has a lot of them to take on a snipe of his own or a range to have a third eye perceptive. Elias Patterson, a better way to have another workout on their own. The better is, they're taking a lot of the great efforts here to take on their own. The better one is, snipe zone, long shot. I'll find out about one of the two for Patterson and Otto. There's a lot of a great range in between there, guys. Back to you. Nearing a five-minute mark in a period, two points to score Carolina. And the win will play it up for Stahl as he finds Martina. He loses that effort and now Orloff will have it again back to Martina. Here he comes to Jarvis, this one will race it out. The back pass over to Martina, no good. And Martina will try to stay clear, but unable to have it to Stahl. Freeman now finding Lindholm. Find Starling. Get a little bit of an in-between here as Orloff will now find it again on Martinuk. Here's Buck Colson. Chance of the play. Save! And this one right towards the net. Pop Colson will have that rebound in. Shot stop by Kochakov. This one will keep that puck in the corner. And now he will find it again on Martinuk. To over to Jarvis this time. On shot range, save by Temko. This one's really like keeping that bat out of here. I don't say why not, but that must have been a hard way to get this one through. The pass by Skate again to Chaffield. Chaffield up and it stopped. Demko will hold that puck in with just only five minutes remaining in the first. Teams are ready to make the next face off. Carolina up by one. And the way we'll put it in for the Turkings. Stop by Demko. Under five minutes remaining in the first, trying to let Demko stay alive in the first period. It's 
not always easy when you start that one off. And away will bring it in. Here's Pesky. Pesky finds the against And that one's going to be a delayed penalty call coming up on Vancouver. Oh, that's not good at all. He must have had that one somebody tripped over. And this one was keeping it out of it. It's not, not a great sign. They were looking like this is not turning what they're expecting to play for. And this is what happens now. Because when you don't play it in between, that's going to make a, a, a worse nightmare on your fuel. You're going to have a tough time ever up there, and you're not going to succeed through. This is why they, they cheat out. We don't really just do that one too much. Lafferty is sent to the penalty box with a tripping call, and the power play is coming up on Carolina. First penalty kill for Vancouver, and now this will be their power play coming up for Carolina. And so we will put it in for Vancouver. Here's the door off. He will clip that out of here, and this one will give it again to Burns. He will now find Teravainen. Teravainen to pass over to Drury. Drury now finds Fetchikov. And Teravainen will try to make a move again to Burns. Burns finds Fetchikov. He will now try to keep that puck alive. Trying to make his way in there to try to keep the puck in his own. Jury right behind the net. He will now find Burns trying to get to Svechikov. Carolina deep shot! Oh, what a save by Demko! What an excellent saving stop and bound. Now they're ready to do the next face off. Still a lot of time left to get this one done for the power play before the end of the first period. And as now when the wing puts it in, Cole will swing it out. Svechikov keeps it alive. And this will be the end of the power play for Carolina. Now to a 4-4 four four attack. As those are set to the penalty box. You know, I was really stumped out. This wasn't really easy of what they was expecting for those. And that really is going to let that somebody get hurt. You're going to have a hard time to get that one here and get back up. Nobody's going to like it. Nobody's going to love it. And a little play name for Carolina. You will have it again to Jarvis, and this one will carry that one out. He now finds Jury. Jury shot that save. Great chance ever for Tatcha Demko with 50 seconds on a 4 on 4 zone. Right behind the net to JT Miller. Save by Jarvis, and this one picks up a rebound. Again to Jury. And Slavin spins across. And open shot to Burns, shoots, this one's blocked by Cole. And Drury will now try to get over to Slavin. Get into Jarvis. Down to 10 seconds for the 4-4. Four four. Here's a rush, he misses wide, what a save by Demko. Oh, that was better. All that effort really had taken it in there. I was never seeing how this one is going to come along straight out of it. The man's still around, and now this will get back to Jarvis. And Slavin will now have their chance effort here to get to Jury. Jury, chance for the play, saved by Demko. What an excellent shot range. This one stays out perfectly. Looks to Pesky. Pesky now finds Svechikov. Svechikov shot, misses wide. Knows his time is about to expire. Power plays ended up here for Vancouver. No chance for the goal. You're going to let them try to like keep on their own without getting away from it. You know, sometimes it doesn't happen with their power play. All that advantage in there because the Hurricanes made a trip on somebody. And this is not really what they're supposed to be playing for. We don't want this one to be attacked. We don't want to get to tossed out. They really have to make sure that they swing these keep in and saving on the game to have a right and back. All this happens now is just going to keep on going worse and worse. And outside will be on Carolina. After he went down, under one minute to go.
Officials are ready to drop that puck in into the center ice zone. And a win will put it in for Patterson. Hughes making his way over right toward corner. That one will broken up the chain. And a great steal by Chatfield as he now finds it again to Svechikov. Svechikov trying to get over with the move shot. Oh, what a save here by the goaltender. Now I know what you get. I just really noticing that was a, like a hard play and bountiful. They got one perfectly right. Uh, over there finds Orlov. Orlov shoots, trying to put a rebound in. This one stays out. And that's going to end the first period. Tight game so far. It's all day, every day. 2-1, Carolina lead in game five. Be back for the second period. Hey y'all, welcome back to EA Sports of the Stanley Cup Final. We're ready to start the second period. And off we go, we're ready to start here for the second period and the park drop in Vancouver. I had a lot of great takes in between as I'll send over to Nickel and Puma for the first period recap. How amazing they did this one here. As I, as I noted before that the Hurricanes have been smashing it out. I mean, I don't know what's going to keep on happening right now. All they done say is they were really are surprised right now. How can they ever do this? All that expectation is they really are playing it for so long. The better reason is a lot of it about power ranging out there, and they've been like totally getting worked in the round that much. Seriously, this was definitely a hard game matchup it is. But not really seriously at all. Vancouver's are trying to like snap it out. They really wanted to like try to get them in and win. The win for Vancouver. But a shot misses wide and this one will go back to Pedersen. And it's now finding Terabinen. He gives it again to Svechikov. On his way down. The rebound playing it to, to Terabinen and then a backhander. This one will take it away. Paul Linder's got it this time. Terabinen trying to squeeze it up a little bit. You'll clear that puck out. I see whistle on Carolina. Now they're waiting for our next face-off. 18.47 left to go for the start of the second period. Wink puts in. Now he finds it over. Shot. Set here by Spetsikov. Krochikov. And now finding Terrifying in. Terrifying has it again. I'll go. Oh, shit! Club saved by Demko! 18.29 to go in the second period. Trying to let Levi in the zone and trying to let that one get out of the way. Now the win for Tatra Demko's team as I know Hughes will have it out of here. And here's McKayev with the chance. The playable on the effort. This one will take the puck away as Pesky will now find it again to Drury. Here's a chance now. Natchez shot, it's blocked. Now back to Natchez. He John finds it over to Shea. Shea, right moving around the tour of the bat, and this one will not carry in there as we can will have the other way. Here's another takeover and again to Miller. Miller shot, stopped by Krutchikov. 17.41 left to go in the second period as they'll have another face on Brown's way. And they're ready to go. Here's a win for the, for the Vancouver Canucks. And then Snow will roll back the other way now finding Pasky. Here's a chance now to Martinuk. Martinuk will fire that puck right around the net. Again to stall, and now he finds it over again to Skay. Skay shot off the blocker. And this one goes back to Martin, and this will clear that one out back to Besser. Besser chance by Freeman. Freeman loses that one. And here's Martin up with a chance on the other side. He'll find that one around the net. Jarvis now playing again to Burns. Burns gets again to Slayman and shoots it. Locked it up, and it's back to Patterson. Here's Freeman right the other way. Trying to find an open more room, and he will try to make his way towards the attacking zone. He'll dump the puck out, and Burns will have it again. Back to Martinuk. Get our chance now to Fast. Fast gives it over. Fakke Anime losing the effort. Freeman will try to get that one out. 
right toward the right wing. Bumps around the corner, and Burns will have that one with the rebound in. Make a good effort chain, finding to get a nose in. Nose in gets to Clark Kanami. Slavin back again to Burns. Burns shoots, block the shot. And Slavin, got it there. This one will not get it in there that time. Zidoro trying to map the boat, able to get the puck battle. And Jasper Fast got tripped up on him because he is in the penalty box. Well, not so good at all. Jasper Fast is really like in the penalty box. They're expecting it. It's not a great sign call. Don't take the effort if you want to try to stop him. If you're playing on defense, don't take the effort if you're wanting to take the blade. Try to take the effort of the puck as you can. Conflict coming up for Vancouver with 1537 to go. Now on the wing, here's a chance for Hughes again to Patterson. Patterson shot, crouched it down, and it's back to Pesky. Tara Biden will try to clear the puck out. Devco will now release his over to Hughes. Hughes now finding again to Suter. Suter trying to cut it down. Right toward the back. And this one will carry in here to Aho. Big hit! Ow! That's a big hit out there. And this one will try to carry inside. Here's another one to Aho. And he will try to fire it again. Oh, he puts Skeletino! And he will not get that puck to tie this game up. Great puck check here for the Hurricanes. You know, it doesn't battle at that range left enough lately. Does it really matter to us? I mean, no. They really are just trying to, like, suit them up. They're trying to, like, make sure they have that one in the, in the right moment. And this doesn't mean to anybody who can try to, like, leave them alone. I know it doesn't really happen to us, but it's going to take a lot of time to have the effort. And this is not going to count. I think he was moving a little bit too soon. I think he was reaching right now, and I'm thinking, like, wait, why is that a goal? How is this going to happen? Well, I think there might be a problem with that one there. And will this be an under review? I don't think so. Maybe it's not. I think he was in a net. I think he had a little bit too much timing out there. That could be a problem. So this time it's not a goal. This one will stay out. Uh, lucky make here for Karkin. Kochikov, he just had that one coming in. Big save on play. You know, that was like really close, and I don't know what happened to Kochikov. I thought that was going to be an error for sure. But that one saved his day. He didn't really think he was going to leave it alone. But that's how it happened. He just made that one easier enough to have that one stoppage. Thankfully, he had that one to cover the puck up. And, he didn't, and I thought the air one just made that one in the net. That's going to be a hard problem to get in. And the wind will put it in for Vancouver. Here's a Ronin. And he went down. Back again to Sleeman. Power play is over, and full man ranges on. Definitely was really close enough to make this one a great save. But that one didn't really think, I thought that Coach Cobb was going to make that one in there. And I thought, where the puck went? I don't know where, where his puck just went into, but I think that must have happened here if there's another way to have that one broken it up. They're not really like letting it go by, and that one is going to be a bad idea to have it in there. Oh boy, Michael Bunny. They were having too many penalty calls out there. Number power play chance for Vancouver Canucks nearing the back half of the period. Now the win for Stahl as Chapman will now have it again to Stahl. And here's a chance to Orlov, he's going to clear that out. And Patterson will now have it again to Goldwinder. Bumps up to the corner of the wall. And trying to reach it in here, Chapman will now have it out. Demko will now try to send it over again. And then Patterson will now have it again in Hughes. Hughes making his way right toward the right wing. The rebound put up. And here's Lindholm, Orla. Here we get a Chapio, and now finding Jarvis to clear that out. Looks like the Jordan Stahl is on the attack. Here comes the take, and the rebound! What a 
saved by Deco! Are you kidding me? How did he hold on to that? I think I guess that must have mean that he was a lot of the bigger saves that he's trying to like put it in. He's not laying out and getting right in the way. But hey, how do you feel like if you're playing as Coach Goff? That's what happens most of the time. Well, Deco made a great save on that one. Under 12 minutes in the second period. Now and away to their next face-off. 2-1 to score. Down to 41 seconds for Vancouver Power Play. And away we'll put it in for the Curricades. Ah, they trying to get back to skate. Turbine in. And that one will misfire it out. And this one puts an error for the Carolina Hurricanes passing percentage. Now back to Tebow Carolina. Oh, uh, here comes a display. Oh, what a shot! What a save there by Demko! He just made it unstoppable! Oh, no big save! This one goes right back. The block is shot. Save! Another chance to play? No, oh, Demko! Unbelievable! This one is stopping crazy. They're not loving that far. Yeah, I mean, how could this happen now? Tatcha Demko was really like. All in pursuit. He's a little bit trouble out there. That's finding another way to try to save that pump in the day. I mean, that was like nowhere out. Another bad save. Now he will hold it on with just under 11, with just 11 minutes to go. Now they're off to do the next face off. Here's the number take here, and now Burns will have it again to Slayman. Slayman shoots, and it's stopped by Demko. Number take on this effort right now, and we're coming down here with just only 10.52 left to go. Off to another win for Stahl. And give us a cut. This one scares out. And that will end the full pressure. Jury will not kick that out of here to Burns. Oh, here comes this play. Chance scores! Chance Jury! Unable to take this goal and now extends it. You know how clean that is? That's what happens right now to Jack Drury. He was close to the up and walk. And when Brett Burns was making this one in there to Jack Drury, he had a one-time effort. Made this one a goal with the great chance. I was really expecting that this one was like playing and bouncing hard. Not how it happened, but that one great. Right. Hurricanes are up by two with a 3-1 game. Trying to beat the Canadian team in the finals. This was never happened before, but all that up after happened with the Florida Panthers getting over. And there's a goal on the other side. Pedersen with a chance. So, I've never seen what happens now with Blaze Pedersen, but that really happens to be a, a great pass, and this one has been blocking up. All that is just used to what's happening in there, we were not expecting the ball to slip in the play. So, there's a lead to the 3 2 to score for Carolina against Kent and Vancouver. And it's now Pedersen with the win, and so Linder will now have that one in the corner. Chances with a fighting effort. And here's Drury. Give the bunny. And it's over now to Natchez. Again to Drury. Drury shot, left save. Pass to midway mark in a second. Three to the score. And this one will try to get the next goal in if they have a chance. Andre Svechikov. What a better way to have a lacrosse move and a better one to have a power rate and a range out there. It's all for skill up. This is why his ability is coming in straight. But all happens now when his chance is, and this one is a great way to have that one attacking in. All for the cross from up behind or from side from the net. Can be a great way to make the rebound. And a little play it in for Vancouver. Great news will now have it again for Holbender comparison. You will now find Holbender. Holding her chance to play, slaving with the puck steal. And Tara Bynum trying to clear that out. 
Kusura and Sketch a couple of them over to gain the sleep in. So Brandon will try to carry that one out while right running that. And here's the running. Right toward this way, right toward the other side. Passing over toward the outside. Sprinting his way down. Bumped up the corner and stopped by Krochakov. 8.55 left to go in the second period. He will now try to stop that one along. Now they're ready to do one again. Carolina still up by one. And now another win for Carolina. And here's Miller. Chance to play and save off the by the goaltender. That one was very close. This one was not an easy option. I don't know what's going to keep it in there, but that's how hard it's going to get. And a pass saved by Demko. Canucks are sliding in right toward the attacking spot. Looks over to Miller. Great block by Paskey. Passier with the puck steal. Oh, smash up in the corner over the wall. That's going to put a payback on them. And Martinick will now have it over. Pass has been losing out and stretched it over back to Marina. Marina shot and broken the glass out there. They're going to need to replace a new one. I think that puck must have get that glass. They're going to have to send him a bill already. Are they sure they're going to have to place him a bill? For real? <laughs> I think there is. There is a yes. After a new replacement for the win for the glass, puck continue, plays continues and now finds Bunny. And Nages will have a year away again to Garland. Garland finds to get a lane home. And Nages will now have it out. And Ruby will now send it over. Here's Garland with the attack. Oh, saved by Kochikov. What a beauty stop. Now they're off to the next face off. It's a 3 2 game, Carolina. The win for Elias Lindholm. Misses the shot wide and Garland will now have it over. In a range inbound to Lindholm. Trying to bound for the loose puck. And he will clear that one out. Michael Bunning with the rush. He's now behind the net. He finds Burns. He gives the slave and shoots it. Good rebound. This one stopped by Demko with under seven minutes to go. Now they're ready for another face-off. Still a 3-2 game Carolina up ahead. Patterson wins the face-off as Cole will now have it again to Freeman. And Oglander will now have it again to Patterson. Here's another chance at Bird. The puck rebound puts in for Spetchikov. He now finds Slavin. Slavin now finds Spetchikov. Spetchikov went down hard and Ago gives it again to Burns. Burns gets to Ago. Ago spins around, right love save by Demko. He will stop that when a whistle and play. Under 6.30 to go in a second. Now they're off to do it again. The win for Sebastian Ago. Shoots one. Big pack stop here by Demko. And Burns will now try to handle it over again. The Slavin again now to Avo. Stick with it. Taravina now finds again the Slavin. Slavin now gives again to Taravina. Shoots it. And that one misses and redirected. Slavin trying to get back to Burns. Slavin giving it over to Burns. The cut it down to Avo this time. And it's going to a rebound. That one goes right toward the corner. Taravina lost the effort. Here comes Cole. Slayman will now try to get over again in the back and again on in there. Missed the chance play and now this one gives it over to the, uh, on the ice of the center. In a position, centering feed. Looks on in there. Stop by Kochikov. Coming down to a five minute mark in the second period. Carolina still up ahead. Now they're ready to do one more. We made it We are tired as faster as that tiny kid is. You can't just 
make that win, and you can't make him sorry for Besser. Five times. You know, sometimes that happens now because that one fits the quarter, and this one just got him loose. We don't have the brand to do this, though, and they don't really expect how that comes in. All that happens in now is just how it flips, and the next one finds it. Carolina and Vancouver are tied up by three, and they are trying to get hard right now, but hopefully there might be a great way to try to save it all. Just a better chance effort right now after Quinn Hughes. That might have been what they're taking in any I don't know what's going to keep the chance effort alive, but that might be a pressuring inbound that can take all of it when they can. Now to ready to do your next face-off. Vancouver and Carolina are tied up with 4.32 to go. For the win for Miller. Oh, he bumped down right after him. Okay, I'm going to be getting fast. Pass. Shoots! Blocker stop. And now he will find it over again to Skate. Skate finds Pesky. Pesky gets to Nozin. Nozin moving inbound to take the rejection out of it. This one will stay out. And it's now finding Hughes again to Miller. Miller. Hold it away. Shay trying to lead that out. In the zone. Looks it again, finding pass. Chance of play effort. McKeon tries to get over and now find the arrow away. To Besser. Paschke. Now tries to make his way again to Bunning. Bunning lost the effort this time. And he's going to roll around the net. Natchez. Finding stage. He shot that save by Demko. Oh, that was just how awesome this is. He didn't expect how this is going to happen like that, but that was what they've got. Now they're off to their next face off. Three and three is a score. Trying to keep it in here. Here's Garland. Garland right toward the corner. Tries to give over to Lindholm. Blocking that one out of here. And Slayman has it again in HS. He pass. Messed that one up. Pop Colson moving it in. Chance to play. This one was carried out and now finds Drury. Well, they're not going to like it at all. I think that this has happened right now. He was drewed out. So that's going to be a medical attention room. Wow, that is going to be a piss sick kid. I think somebody is going to have to try to like stop on him. And he's going to get in the medical room as fast as he can. We will have with you soon right now because this one's going to be a little bit bad out there for Vancouver to try to stop on them. Wow. Now the win. Here's Garland. Good cut inbound for Garland. Burns trying to pump it out. And stop. And that's going to trip on somebody and this is going to be Michael Bunny. A second chance in the penalty box. Another power play on Vancouver. Stall and Chaffee will have it. Stop by Pedersen. 
Chaffee will now have an air away to stall. Stall, looking his way up, Love save. Demko holds that one in, we're down to her 90 second mark in a second. Now they're off to do one again. And the win will put it in for Vancouver. The Canucks are back in the offensive zone. Great steal, and their team goes outside. Short and the team wins as this one's still still coming down the clock. Slayman trying to roll over to Burns. Just only one minute left to go, and Slayman got a little bit of a left start out there. Shot blocked. And here's Hovinder. Hovinder makes his way in front, and saved by Kotikov. Burns gives it down to Stahl. And this one blocking up the play. Holding it right toward the corner. Trying to leave that one out of here. This one will now take it. And this one will fire it out. Bunnies ready to get going. That will end the power play here. Both teams are definitely on a hard range to put in bounds. I'm pretty sure that this is really like a tight game. All that happened right now, I mean, they really are going out of the way. For all their chance effort, they're never going to slow it up when they're down. They want to like try to like let it be out there for one day at a time. It doesn't really matter to most of the people, but that's what they're doing. Good pushing strength effort. It's going to keep on bad angles. And the win will put it up for Carolina, and that ends the second period. Both teams tied up for three and three. Power play goal. Not a chance, but great chance for Bassar. Third period coming up after the break. Two down, one to go. Third period about to begin. Well, it's been a one wild night out there, and we are finding a way if there is a win off between the two, and it can be only one that will try to win the whole thing. A with the other team that could be going back to game six. Let's go, there is a face fact. We start the third period as right now it burns. Burns made his way right around the net. And Suda will have a chance to get to Patterson. Got a little bit bumped up to squish off the wall. And here's a chance to lead it. This one's stacked again by Kochikov. Once again, it's Kochikov. They're not have it again to, to Burns, and this will get back to Patterson. And oh boy, that's a big hit. Take over in. Oh, uh, I think that bad timing must have been taking a little bit of ice off of it. Didn't really think he was going to get there. Yeah, that problem must have been happening in there. That one was weak off it too soon. Might have choose a little bit of a change on it. There's a choice. Right now, we do have an update here as Terry Cruz will be sending him by for Jack Jury. What do you have here, Terry? Thanks, guys. I was able to talk to one of them. On with his better consequences, this happened to be one of the medicals. I talked to one of them, and this wasn't really all that happened to me. All that bad stuff in this game has been really been out under redemption. It was not really what they were expecting it now. Because of this point, they are really are making this one feel like it's un unfair at all. And this one, after a hit, this wasn't really uh, really well enough that they're trying to like let them get away with this. All this happens now is getting a little bit too much force bit with the contact. And this time that Jack Jury will have to try to see what he can do to try to keep that one out. And hopefully Jack Jury will miss everything, but hopefully this might be a little bit of change off to get that one in there. I'll find out if there's another way if that for another place to have an update on the injury list if there's another one coming in. Back to you guys. With the gamers here and finding Natchez again to Slavin. And Slavin will not have Bunny. Funny shot misses! Oh, that one's a little bit of an untwiggle target out there. And now he will roll again to Gears. Gears Miller. Miller with a puck and a chance. Releasing the play effort. This one is back again to Slavin. 
And Foss now finally get a bunny. Bunny chance to Foss. Fast shoots. This one's no deflection in. Over and out with the shot. Saved by Demko. 1703 left to go in the third period. We will now have another face off. Officer ready to drop the puck. Just a tie game between a three and three. It is away for Vancouver. There's no finds again about calls in. The calls in loose one. And now we will find it again to pass. Here comes fast with a chain. Oh, one both believable save this is. And now he finds Paul Colson. Chance ever in front by the Gangers. And here's another one with a take. Shots been blocked. Kakanami will try to reset with Freely. And will now try to give over a pass. Shot stopped by Demko. 16-16 left to go in the third period. Next face off on its way. Here's another win for the Carolina Hurricanes. You will now find Peschke. As he shoots up the stick and this one goes right back again to the Hurricanes. Here's Skay. Skay right again. And here's Fetchkov. Fetchkov be Masters! Oh, what a cut by Andre Fetchkov. Yeah, picking up the lead just not by one. Don't expect now it may be too late. Andre Fetchkov had that small goal. That had to be really important. You know, you got to believe what Andre Sechkov's been doing. Try to bet him about him and slap that one in there. That's like, uh-uh, I don't know how that happened. That's what they were expecting to do. And this one was really caught into everybody's attention. Now, the next face-off coming up here for the Vancouver and Carolina Hurricanes. They're in a 15-minute mark in the third period. And here's the win for the for the Hurricanes. You'll have a chance to fire that puck around the net. Here's the takeover. Shot stopped by Demko. Terrifying now finds to get a skate. Skate. Can't hold the effort out there. Uh, well, now I'll find again to Terrifying and here's another take. Jerry with a chance at for now he finds Matthews. Here's holding their shot. Oh, what a terrific save out there by Kutchikov. Unbelievable. Offside whistle on Carolina. That was excellent for Kutchikov he had made. You know, it doesn't happen when Kutchikov has made this with a lot of bigger type saves. You have to willing to have that with the right perception to get this one stopping up at the save. This doesn't mean that everybody keeps on saving, but there's only one of the goaltenders that's going to try to stop one of them. No, like stopping one of the goaltenders right in between and have the better range and effort, this needs to be done. And he's going to poke it up. Here's an error one for Miller. And a pass down. Fires it. We're looking for redirection. This one stays out. And a shot for rebound. And this one stopped by Kutchikov. Under 15 minutes in the third period. Fans are starting to go live right now in Rogers Arena. And off to do it again. The win will play an end for, for the Carolina Hurricanes. He'll have it again to Jarvis. Jarvis now finding a pass over. Stall. Looking over to Jarvis. Shot. Pack save by Demko. 14 23 left to go in the third period. Ready for a next face off. Now they're off to do it again. It is a win for J.C. Miller. We may now find Besser. Besser now trying to get back over, and Jarvis will now have it now over again. And a big pick! That's a big smackdown out there! That one's going to like be an like, unbelievable hit. Nobody's going to love her like that. I mean, I don't know what's going to keep on going. But this one doesn't really like it. They don't really like to get hit. They really want to like try to stay out. I mean, all that slate effort, I mean, not turning what they're expecting to do for it. But if you're going to do it that way, I mean, 
Kyle Williams with the tackle. The chance there, honey, while we're getting a call. Cold chance. Back to propose it. Let him move around, puts it away. And here's Slavin, he will now have it in. And Cole will now find out the puck goes in. The chance have been a play. Shot stopped by again by the goaltender. And he's over now again. Save! Back to rebounded by Slavin. And here's another one. I see whistle on Carolina. Alcohol wins the faceoff, and this one will clearly take it out, and then this will be an arising on Carolina. For the next week, the highest Patterson. Great block by Aho. That's excellent. I was really expecting what Aho was really doing it. Here comes the rush. And Fox will now have it again to kind of pass the special con. Sorry, keep around the net. And Aho will now have another chance over it again to pass. Aho will now try to keep it out. Moving the puck back and forth in between four canes. Slavin. Slavin, excuse me. Well, found finally again to Burns. The Reds gets again to Slavin and shoots it. Glove save by Demko. Here in the back of the period in third, it looks like it's a close game this far. It is now a 4-3 game, Carolina. Now the next faceoff will be Pedersen. Holding there with a chance right over in toward the corner. Oh, that's going to make a smash kick go down. That is like, oh, ouchie moment. That is just unbelievable. I don't know what they were expecting now, but that's just like very hard. How weak it is, that strength doesn't really matter. What they're expecting to play for, that's going to be hurtful, painful, on their way. Running, fine skate. Skate, fine pesky. Passy loses it up with a shot. That was stopped by Demko. And Presti got a little bit of hit in between. Pat saved by Demko. Here's another one to point views again to Suter. And he lost that one, and so we'll give it back to Stahl. And now he passed to Tara Minen. Here comes the trait. And Lingo with the puck steal. And he's been checked. That's going to be a, a penalty kill. Apparently coming up on Carolina Hurricanes. You don't know play how this happened. That's going to happen with Stretchikov. That one's going to be a tripping payback for the lesson. You're not doing what they will. They have to suppose an offer. A chance for a tie breaking in the between. Between the Hurricanes and the Canucks. Power play is on. And now we're going to do one again. The win will put it in for Oppo, and Chaffee will now have it again Oppo. Fired up on the right of that, and this will get back to Mikheyev. Trying to score a chance on a power play goal, and Suter will have another chance up right here, and right towards the left wing. Chaffee went off a little target angle out there, and here's Sarah Vinan. With another net, he finds Oppo. Oh, shot, club save. Past the big wave up in the period in the third, just 9.34 to go in the third period. Now they're off to do one again. For three is to score. With the win, here's Besser. Fine skews. And Hoaglander. Now able to try to like set him up in. Looks it over. The buck was winding down out there. I see straight off for the Carolina Hurricanes. Trying to give over to Saul. 
Stall looks again at Jarvis. Try to watch out for the blank effort. And Stall for a backhand out. Save. That's another good stop here by Demko. He just made this one holding on the back. I mean, when and what are you going to do that? Playing it like that? It's just how hard it is going by. Great chance effort out there for the man of man advantage. And here's Jarvis. Now playing over there again to Stahl. Stahl shot. No chance ever in play out there. He now finds Poplander. Looks like that someone's ready to get back out there. Stay. Loses that one. And that will be the end of the period. Well, you know how it happened. That's what they really are expecting to let him to stay as long as they can. But how much time? I mean, that's part of a quick, quick, quick question out there. I mean, I just really wanted to know if one of the guys and his teams can play the air hockey, because that's a little bit more important than doing a game on ice. I mean, you gotta hit the mid. You gotta commit that. With a screen, and this one sends over back to Garland. And he will race that one offside. That's on Carolina. 721 left to go in the third period. He will start things off. And the Hurricanes win the face off. Fired up on a run in that. And we'll get another hit, and that's a big hit on takedown. Here's another one, three men inside. First stop, no play! Oh, what a save! That is just unbelievable. There are just too many of them that's going to have to like keep the right in between. But that needs to be a little bit of a change off for a ballpoint pen to get that one right to, right to side out of how this stuff works. You know, I used to really don't say about Tapa Duco. He's really like trying to like save it all as he got. I mean, when it's red, I mean, you really don't have it anyway. Because at that point... And there's another win. And now Freeman will have it. Here's a cut and bound with a shot and stop again by Demko. Now for Nate Jaffield. Looks over again to Army. Like Army out. Cut and bound with a loose puck. And it will now send it over again on my asking him. Here's Fester. Near the wall. We'll pass over to center ice, and you'll now try to make another way in. With a shot blocked it up by Karchakov. 5.53 left to go in the third period. Get ready for the next tip off. And here we go. Next face off is on its way. Let's get that covered. And here's another one. With a shot, it's been blocked up and redirected. There is no sin. Find final at C. This one will now find again at Orlock. And this one will now give it back again to Bluebird. And here's another takeover. Carolina back the other way with 520 to go. Here's another takeover. And here's the 30. And a shot, make it up easy, this one is staying out, and what a save by Kotchikov. He's been doing really well. All that happens right now, I mean, gotta keep that one in play, and well, they don't really want to take all that tree effort, I mean, he's doing really well. And he went down, and this one goes right back again to the HS. HS, fire William. 4.23 to go in the third period. Let's see if you can make any saves! We are tied! Patterson, the team does it again. Well, can't say now, can't say never, they're all even. How much speed do you really want to be? Passing Bushy Bob, that's just unbelievable, okay? The 
if I'm going to trip that break, this one is really lucky, huh? You can see now that the Hackett and Hammerfield made this one an easy change. All that score was just unbelievable. And it's a win. Now we only ended up the other way. Avo, this one is broken on the play. Puck sailing all the way down back. Now finds again, Spectacrov and Slavin. Well, now we're going to get to Aravainen. Aravainen trying to look his way in. Suits, try to put it in. Save the bounce, stays out. He will not find Horone. And here's Patterson. Patterson making his way up. Club saved by Kochukov. Smetchikov right toward the wing. He will stop that puck in between and now he finds again the gears. Oh, what a great tack down. And Terra Barnett will have that one in there on the other side to stall. Chosen play for a rebound. No take here in the bell. Oh, there is an upheld coming penalty on Carolina. Yeah, you can't do that. I mean, when, when you're doing it on the on play, you can't trip somebody over. That's going to like, take a number to be call, and they're going to get that lead as soon as they can. Here's the tape. Who's having to say bye? Oh, yeah, that's Patterson. It's one of the better takes over maybe kind of the best play on the, on the goals of the night. But I say right now, whenever you play for some real reasons, this one is going to keep up with him going with a straight angle as it can. But that's my prediction, guys. Offside on Carolina. Now we're about to do our next face-off. So we will play it in for the Vancouver Canucks. He decides to stop one down. And here's another one. The pass over to Patterson. Patterson, looking it in, and it brokens up the play. And here's the KF. He will now try to find the arrow way. Looks over now. On a shot for a basket, this one is taken down. Two minutes remaining in the third period. Here's Mikaya, not finding Besser. And this one will come in. This one will stop and squeeze by Kuchikov. And this one now trying to kick it up. And this one flings it up and into the netting. Nearing down the final minute in the period. They're looking like they want to have a lead. Now to win. Here's another take. Shoots it. And it's a stop by Kutchikov with a nearing a 90 second mark in the third period. Listen to the fans. They wanted to get this goal to have the game win or Carolina. Now to win. Here's a take. The pass over to Kokanami. Big slap down here. Here's Skate, chance to play, shot, slap by Demko. And it's back to Verona. Look again to Suter. Oh, it's a big low collision out there. That's massive. Massive out there with the bigger hit. Nothing happened already, and I don't know it's going to keep on coming. Just one minute left to remain in the period. Top play is over. Both teams are ready to make a responsive effort. And now he flies it over to Mikheyev. Suter trying to bring it down right to the team. And here's an outtake. Pashki right down. He now finds Mikheyev. Shot blocked by Teravainen. And here comes Teravainen. Oh, he's going to do it. Take it in. Herber behind the net. This one misses a shot. This one goes right back the other way to Miller. Slamming way down. Burns trying to get over and now finally get a Slavin. The cut racing about, trying to work his way through. And there's a chance effort out 
there are nine seconds left. The chair time for the sleigh band. Here's the chairs. Chairs. Sleigh band. Don't go. Put it shop. It's blocked. And it's where we are going to overtime. Wow. This is the longest game. But the next goal can be it. We'll find out if there's another win or not after this. All right, with some period takes in between, let's have a look of how they did in, in the regulation period in game five. And this is where I'm just going to take over for a one last chance. What's your take there, guys? I think this is going to be a Vancouver Canucks. So I'm thinking they're going to like make their way and they're going to step on back and they're going to make this sort of win. A lot of chance of her right there and this is going to be a lot of a great takes in between. I'd probably say that this one is not going to be easy enough to have this one with a better way to get that right through it. And I'd probably say Vancouver Canucks are going to get back into it. Possibility? I'm going to say Carolina Hurricanes are going to get that one in there. I think a better chance right now that might win. Well, as we get right into this, this overtime is brought to you by Adidas. Here we go. Last one does it all. Win to finish or a win to move on to game six. Let's hope that there's a win or a well. Here we go. Time in game five in Vancouver. Let's find out if there's a winning chance to move on to game six for Vancouver or a win for Carolina. And this game starts now. Smetchikov started in, saving off by Demko. Got a little star range out there. He's going to get that one laid up already. Doesn't make the consequences that bigger. Doesn't really mention that they were going to make this one a lot harder than they expected to. Playing in for so well, they didn't want that one to get right out of the way. The deep pass over. Unable to connect it from here. Sebastian Alba will now have another chance over to Svechikov. He will fire that right around the net. Tino Turbine and has it again to Burns. And Slayman can't think he was going to get there. Back again to Slavin, and he will now find the pass over to Ako. Ako is right toward the corner, and he will try to make another move out there. Pass over now to Slavin. Then he gets again the pass again to Ako. Now find Slavin. Slavin shoots! Saved off by Denko, and this one will get back again to Ako there. That one smashes up very badly, and now this goes to Patterson. Better saved by the goaltender. Off with another chance ever, Bessie to win! Denied by Kochakov. 18 minutes in the overtime period in game five. You'll have our next goal with a win, or well, this could be the end of it for all. Now Stahl wins the face off, as Slater will have it the other way. Pass over now to Bunning. Bunning will slide that one across by any Saul. Saul shoots off saved by Demko. Closing range and mount. You now try to kick the puck over. And here's another one to Stahl. Stahl will try to cut that puck off the zone. Trying to get a good hustle for Stahl. And they just will now have another chance effort to play again to Bunning. Playing to give a go again to Pesci. Bunning. Open up. Stay shot. Blocked up by Besser. Looks now finding the stay. Again to Bunning. Shoots one in. Redirected right toward behind the net. And Demko will hold it up with just only 16.49 to go. 
do you really say that it's gonna happen like that? I mean, I don't know what's gonna get let and go in, but I thought that buck was gonna like fly in and go with the ricochet. I didn't really just make that one a little bit too much confidence out there. I mean, that's gonna be out of the way. Two squint twos, you will now have a deal away. Can you find Spesky right toward the other side? You will now find it over to get a nose in. Nose in, able to get that out of the way, and Aronic will try to deliver it out. Aronic, finding Hughes. Hughes will now have another chance effort in play again to Mikaya. A little bump up for the kick here. Moving around, firing out of the zone. Pesky, get the fuck out. Goes in. Finds Cloud Kennedy. Here's a chance. Fast to win it. Let's say we are still tied up with only 15.51 to go in overtime. Now they're we'll off to do one again. Abu uh, wins the face off and his Burns will now have it again to Slavin. Slavin with a cut. Don't have the answer open. Looks in this Fetchikov, and he lost that control effort. Great stop here with a poke check by Slavin, and now Fetchikov will have it. He'll try to give over now to Tebow Terravinen. Terravinen looks again to Slavin. Slavin to win! Look, save it! We are still tied up again! They're all over right now. How could Dick go uh, make that really was a big save? This doesn't have anybody to make that effort? I mean, no. It doesn't really matter what it's going to take. I mean, how long is it going to happen? Now the little friend and then it's here's Freeman will be ever way again to Lindholm. Garland. Right towards it from the middle. Seven feet to Lindholm shot. Able to stop that one. This one scaries out. Turbine in. I'm going to win it. And this one, no way to get right around through to Demko under 15 minutes to go in OT. Now the win will play it in for Freeman. Freeman will try to let them go in right now toward the other side of it. He's now right over into the attacking zone. Oh, that's a big hello moment. That's an owie moment. You don't say, how owie is that? You know, how painful it is. I mean, I don't know what's going to keep on going in there. They really are expecting right now that is a big hit. They're really just going to let that one shut down. I mean, that's how hard it is. I mean, owie. Club saved by Kletchikov, and you will stop that with under 14 minutes in OT. Now they're off to do the next face-off. Carolina and Vancouver are tied up, but the next goal could be it. Chaffield. We'll now have another chance in response. Trying to get right into it. He made a big hit out there. Jarvis right toward in the corner. He will now try to give over to Martin. Pass over. Here's Chaffield with a win off the glove. Peronic will now have it over in the other way. And he finds the pass to Patterson. Chaffield trying to work his way across in. And a pass off to Stahl. No offside here on Carolina. This one stays inside his own. Hurricanes are passing the puck back and forth. Great chance effort here. They're moving the puck here freely out there. Moving around back and forth. Great work. Marta to win it! This one is stopped by the blocker! And Skitty will back that one in there to get back to Jarvis. Jarvis looking in, sketchy! Lost the puck, he's out of his own. And here's another take to Sula! Stopped by Kochakov! He will now try to give over again to Suda. The pass over to win it! Saved by Kochakov! We are still tied again with 12-12 to go. Just coming down to an overtime regulation, 4-4 four and four is the next goal could be it. And in our win for Hurricanes, they're back in the face-off lead. And here's again Pesky. 
Passy trying to watch it over. And Ozen will now have it again to stay. Stay to win it. Off the glove. And Ooze will have it again of a running. Mikhaev with the chance effort. Sprinting his way through the pass over. Staying with the battle with the rebounding puck. He now finds pass over now to Cock Kennedy. He now finds Burns and he grabs it over to Slavin back on, on ice. Slavin right toward the outside. The give pass to Cock Kennedy. Shoots back saved by Demko. 11 of 2 remaining, you know, for time, trying to let them go in with another take. And now Wayne will put it in for Vancouver. Hughes making a little bit of a big chain out here. Looks like he could take over next. The Hurricanes are battling in for the offensive zone. The deep over to Spachikov, and icing is on Carolina. Now with the faceoff coming on, right in between the two of the alley, it's a tight one. And with a win, on a shot, that's safe here. Good stop by Kochikov. Oh, Tara Martin, gonna take it in. No chance, on a shot. Stop by Demko. Oh, what a close call this is. It looks like the fans are some fun again. I know what they're thinking. I think Demko's really having a lot of fun out there. And that save. No goal for Vancouver as we are passing the past midway mark of the period. Now they're off to do one again. And a win with a shot. Stop again by Tatochikov. And Slavin had that one coming in batted. And Kochikov will not take a chance here. He will try to cover it up. With a win, here's another takeover to Garland. Plus saved by Kochikov. Smetchikov is right toward the other side of it and now finds Taravainen. Here's Stahl finding Slavin. Look again at the Stahl finding Taravainen. Here's the cut. Racing in. Save up the play here by Krotemko. Stahl trying to move it around and now finding Smetchikov again and Slavin. Trying to mess it up with the defender on here. And Stahl to win the game. Demko stops that one. 9-1 to go in that overtime period. It doesn't happen most of the reasons. And sometimes that Thatcher Demko made this one of a great stoppage of the saving. Ely Wild saves does happen to be all the light work he has done. It doesn't really mention what you take. But whenever it takes for you to make this save earlier, that range is a wild one to make the rest out of. And away we'll put it up to Stahl, now finds Pesky. Pesky now finds a get over to Stahl. Stahl, get back to Pesky. Get back to Stahl. Moving it over to Natchez. And they just can't get that puck out. Trying to pull it back in. Here comes another one. They just to win it. Oh, what a save by Demko. That's a big tough one here. Pasky trying to roll it over and now finds Natchez. Trying to roll it in this time. Skay with a chance ever to cut to win the game. Get stopped by Denko. A little bit too close to the goaltender with just AO6 to go. Now the next faceoff will coming in. And we're ready to have that one on board. The wing puts in for JT Miller. Heronic battling for this puck. Miller. Fight again to Besser. Besser moving in. Save by Kochikov. Looks now to Bunning. And Bunning now finding Saul. Cut it down. Bunning lost that one. Great kick here for the Vancouver Canucks as they're trying to step it out. 
Make him go down, you stall. So we begin. This one is nowhere across, and that one stops it in. Too many bodies in a way. Stall will have to try to reset it up. Pesky not finding skate. Save the win, he's game. And this one will not get the deflection in as this one stays out. Bunny will have another chance opportunity play. He finds Skay. Skay going down and this one goes right back to Hughes. Peronic making his way across. Keeping the puck in his own. Here's a chance to play in the effort. Oh, Demko made that one with a lucky save of the night. And Besser. Trying to get out of the way. And here's an hour on the Cock Enemy. Cock has stolen by Lindholm. Heronic. Right over toward the corner. And Nozu will have another chance effort. He will try to make a diagonal pass to Otto. Look to Orlov. Will over again to Chapel and now find Sebastian Otto. Here's a chance to trade. Ready for the rebound. Trying to go for the back end. Face down. Vancouver, what do they expect now? You able to win that? That's what you do. Crown champion. What does he say? Sebastian Ago just made this backhand. He had no chance to go, but backhander makes that one win. What a chance effort, and that is the end of it. Great game. Well, I'm telling you now, this has been a great night. And we all thank you and congratulate to both teams who made it to the finals. Vancouver Canucks and the Broncos. Well, this has been a pretty much exciting right now. And I agree. Do you really love it too? I do. I've always loved it so far. This has been an exciting part of the game. And nothing beats out by anybody. Well, I hope you all enjoyed it too. And for you guys... It's been a special one. Yeah, <laughs> definitely what they need for. I mean, they all loved it. And yeah, <laughs> same thing that all has to happen to anybody. But I mean, you got to play it for all your own. You can't let that one get away with that. So anyway, that should do here for this game. Thank you all for so much for taking care of this part of the game. And this has been a presentation for the conduction of the NHL postseason of NHL 24 on EA Sports. Thanks for joining with us, along with me, Fan, Nickel, and Boomer, and Satellite Terry Cruz, we wish you all a wonderful evening, and with a new season to wrap things up, to get right back into work. It has been so far, now they are the EA Sports NHL 24 of the NHL Stanley Cup champions of NHL 24. This has been a wild one, and I all think you will love it too. Thanks for watching. Have a great evening. Now over to you, Son of Beast. Alright guys, thank you so much. That, that happened to be with only the one game, one game, this happened with this one. And this was nowhere luck of how that happened. We really think we'll take, thank you enough for it. And this one has happened to be the win for the Carolina Hurricanes. Won everything from first to the final round. And that was all happened. Yeah, definitely true. What they can expect now is what they have that one racing in. I was really impressed of how this went on. And nowhere to be stopping in there of how they've done it. Well, better takes than that. It's just how it happens. And they are taking it. Well, bring that one on. So in the meantime, it's time to present your three star players of the game. The third star, we start things over for the Vancouver Canucks. It was happened to be Pedersen that made two goals of this game. Then, the second star goes to Quinn Hughes with one goal and two assists. And Tatcher Demko with the first star player of the game with 85 saves tonight. 
Now with the last chance, here's the total statistics about a day. 90 over 57 for the Carolina total shots on goal. And it was 91 over 65 for Vancouver that made that one a hit. 17-16 timeout attack over 517 for Carolina. It was 92 over 77 passing percentage for Vancouver. Done it all. 47 faceoff wins for Vancouver over Carolina, 44. And it was a 14 minute penalty kill for Carolina over two minute penalty kill for Vancouver. No power play goals in between, just 52 seconds for Carolina and 12.52 for Vancouver. Well, I guess you all expect it right now. This has been a wild game and I can't wait to tell you now the whip, the whip, oh wait, Brian of the trophy. I'm gonna have to give that one a great NHL salute to one of their biggest, Sebastian Oppo, who made this one of the great X Factor players that had done it all. I totally agree. I mean, you gotta say it now, you can't make them go wrong with that. So that should do here for today of this season, and for every postseason of the game. I hope you all enjoyed it. And we will be seeing you all for a new season of NHL 25, Season 4. And we can't wait to have you on the wrap up in this game. It's like a party lit. We're going to bring it up every night. And in the meantime, if you like this video, don't forget to check out other videos here too. Reaction video is returning soon, so don't be freaked out if you see one popping in there later. And part 2 of the vlogs video of the ultimate of the BFTI and Eric Sandy tour plus some special special video for you to keep your eyes on. In the meantime, thanks for joining us here and we will see you again for another great new season of season four NHL 25. This is Sonic Beast and DJ Beast. Follow him on his social media, like the video and subscribe to his channel. If you don't, somebody will. And see you all folks for a while as the NHL 24 of the completed postseason dial of the Stanley Cup. Well, time to end it here, and I guess now it is finished. This is NHL 24 on EA Sports signing out. Take care everybody, till for a new season.